Hello everyone, you're in Endurance Laser Lab. Today we are going to show you how to set up your 10 watt endurance laser. So first of all we have, um, have a look on the table, we have two DC-DC uh, models, uh, they are pretty similar. So we have one regulator for current, another one regulator is for voltage. So here we have voltmeter and ammeter installed, uh, one is in parallel and the other one is serial. So uh, we set up and we set uh, 5 volts as initial as initial voltage to our laser and you see no amps uh, so it doesn't work so now we turn on the laser as you can see and we have the decreasing of voltage to 4.2 volts and only one amp so and we have red diode that is blink uh, that is uh, shining it means that it's a limit of current now Boris will increase the voltage and the current uh, step by step so that we can get the maximum power output so as you can see these parameters they go together so we have 4.5 volts on the left 4.6 and 2.2 amps uh, of stabilized current these DC DC converters they already have a current stabilizer so uh, they will break your diode by the way at the end we install Zena diodes to stabilize oh, no to limit the voltage to make 4.0 oh, 5.2 volts maximum okay while Boris is still changing parameters uh, he's increasing and he plays a little bit as you can see together uh, voltage and the current and the laser is shining pretty good so the uh, the power visible power is uh, increasing okay yeah you can hardly see it by the way but you see that it, it's not decreasing so uh, we are going to increase the current uh, limits so as you can see the voltage is stable now current will grow okay you see that it's almost 3 amps now and 4.8 volts okay so we have it the laser is working everything's fine not overheating let's keep increasing 5 volts almost as you can see and 3 amps let's increase the current we keep increasing current so that while voltage is stable so 5 volts is pretty much uh, maximum for this uh, laser uh, so you should be very very careful with that and for uh, 3.7 amps Okay, we are keep increasing it. The laser is working. Still increasing. So five volts, four amps, and it's still growing. So as you can see, this process takes a lot of time and patience okay I keep increasing it so this entire process is not for people who are in a rush so you don't need to be in a rush you just need to be patient so right now we have four four amps and five volts that is something closer to 20 watt of entire consumption um, on our previous video we had um, something like 22 watts of entire power consumption now we're going to beat that result because we add better cooling system on our 10 watt lasers and we uh, started to use better DC DC models so as you can see this Let's check the temperature. Always control the temperature while you operate and while you do the, these experiments. So it shouldn't be overheated. So we have 5.1 volt and 
4.5 amps sometimes we need to restart the emitter just to make sure that it goes well and you have pure data so it's gonna be closer to 5 amps as you can see everything is goes well oh sorry okay still increasing voltage is increasing power is increasing we beat 5 amps 5 volts still increasing so let's get the maximum power output from this guy we're gonna be closer to 5.5 amps or even more so but uh, yeah we're getting closer to the maximum the laser is getting hotter but it's not overheated we control the temperature okay as you can see the lasers working no blinking maximum power okay so we have closer so if you multiply 5.4 5.5 volts and almost 6 amps so we get 6 amps almost almost there so yeah, set 6 amps. So maximum, we set up the laser, maximum 6 amps and 5.5 volts. And you can see it's working. The power is maximum. The temperature of the heat sink is okay. So uh, the real power consumption is closer to 32.5 volts watts so this is really really powerful laser beam so now you know how to set up and control and uh, set parameters for 10 watt laser if you have any questions please ask and visit our website endurancelasers.com and uh, have a wonderful experience with 10 watt laser bye bye